to the channel before you do anything 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 like that thing on the screen says make sure you subscribe to the channel and make sure you click that post notification bell make sure you leave a like on the channel you know what i'm saying make sure you leave a like on the channel smash that like button make sure you go down below comment something comment how you feeling comment about your day you know comment god is good you know what i'm saying anything just comment 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 something down below interact with us you know what i'm saying and Help us out, share the video, share with your people, share with your family. If you just want to laugh at me, do that, share, and do whatever. Share the video. Um, but today, you already know what I'm doing. But before I even do that, I'm messing up, bro, because I could have just said, if you're part of the family already, what's up? If you're not part of the family, like I said before, you need to go subscribe. Subscribe to the family. Subscribe to the family right now. Lindsay Tires Entertainment, LTE family. We love all y'all, but thank y'all for all the support. But you know, I ain't about to hold y'all up. Today, I am gonna react to the Bituary Remix. Y'all probably don't even know what that is. If you're watching the video, you know what it is. If you don't, then you're watching the video. So it's the remix. The song is by Shorty Shorty. You know the bitch you would dog in your hunger. Bruh. That, that song. And then you got A Boogie on it and Wiz Khalifa apparently. Some people, I looked at the comments underneath the video before I even, like, I clicked the video after I saw it, and I was like, I'll probably react to that, but, ooh, excuse me, excuse me again, oh yeah, so I reacted, I looked at it, and I looked at the comments and all that, and it was like, some people were like, they should have O3 Greedo and uh, Ty Dolla Sign on it, and a lot of people said, A Boogie did bad, some people said Wiz Khalifa did bad on the feature, some people say Boogie did good, and then Wiz Khalifa did bad. And I was like, bro, I might as well just react to it, and then I'll let y'all comment down below and let me know what. And should we comment down below and tell me who you think did good and who did bad? Shorty, shorty part good, apparently. Like, his part is fire. His, like, his whole song is fire. But people think, um, apparently this says, there was other comments about, like, his vocals and, like, how the mixing was and all that. Listen, bro, I've been keeping up on a lot of music lately. I've been busy as heck, but... Yeah, so I'm about to react to this video. Um, well, it's not a music video; it's just a uh, audio, but it'll be on the screen. You guys will see it. The little uh, like, uh, I guess you say thumbnail to cover and all that for the video, I me mean, for the music for the song. But <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna get into this reaction because what we got to lose ain't no time to be wasting, right? You know what I'm saying? Ain't no time to be wasting. Okay, three seconds in. My bad. The video is too. Well, the song is 2 minutes and 58 seconds. The audio. Let's go. And when the video drop, if they do drop a video for the remix, I will react to it. But if they don't drop a video, then it's whatever. It's history. <laughs> All right. Actually, I'm going to just start it over again. All right. 2 minutes and 58 seconds. Let's get it. Oh, oh, you need this beat fire, bro. seconds in i feel like that's what people are talking about i've listened to the i haven't i didn't even listen to the full reg, like regular version with just shorty shorty in it <laughs> excuse me but i could tell that the like his vocals i feel like he like the lyrics i feel like he did it over again and i feel like the original version is it sounds a little bit better after the mixing but it's a remix so i mean obviously the remix is gonna sound different the cover look cool though with Wiz khalifa and uh Supposedly a boogie, they look kind of weird. I don't even look like them, but yeah, anyway, 22 seconds. Let's go. Say, when you and I, it can be us too. Like, I'm in the club, drinking Henny and I'm black and mild. Got my gun and I can win it. I'm black and wild, but I won't do that because that gangster shit is out of style. And that's why I left the club early. 
All right, 36 seconds in, my bad. This is probably going to be the sec last time I stop it for a little minute. But <laughs> I was looking at his genius video, uh, like, before I even, like, listened to the full song, a little, started reacting to it. And he said, he was basically saying that, like, people need to start acting original again because that gangster stuff is played out and all that. Which I agree. I mean, everybody's trying to be a gangster. You ain't got to be a gangster. I mean, if you're trying to hop into the rap game, you can talk about all that gangster stuff, but don't make, like, don't talk about it, like, don't make it the only thing you talk about, bro. Because everybody's trying to be, like, a gangster, you know what I'm saying? I've been on the block selling this and that, why I got, like, five bodies or whatever, bro. You ain't really doing nothing, bro. Like, being a gangster is played out, bro. I agree with him, bro. Like, everybody's trying to be a gangbanger and stuff. Correct me if I'm wrong, but he from Baltimore, isn't it? Because I got some homeboys from Baltimore, and they listen to him, and... They claim, like, he, they say he raw. I mean, there's some song I know by him. I'll probably look up some more music by him. But, yeah, that's all I got to say, bro. I'm I'm stopping. I'm going to stop stopping it, okay? Let's go. Smoking weed and drinking, I be fucking on you every night. Tired of that ratchet shit, you say you need a better life. Telling me keep pouring all these shots that mean a better pipe. Calling me up early in the morning because I hit it right. You ain't no nigga, you just for practice. You could shop in my closet and look like Saks Fifth. Even though my image good, I need a bad bitch. That'll stick that tongue out and get nasty. You ain't really getting money, you a catfish. And I be throwing hella ones because I'm mad rich. Now pick them up, pick them up. Bigger cars, bigger truck, bigger boss, bigger bus. Ride with me, baby, ain't got a ride up. Oh, no. I'm in the Rolls Royce, my friend is in the Benz Coupe And you know it's own, bitch, we never in no rentals Alright, minute 35 seconds in after he said rental Um Y'all saw my face Um Okay, what's Khalifa part? What's Khalifa part was good after the Sax Fifth part Until he started saying Like when the beat started chopping up Like bigger car, bigger truck, bigger house, bigger Something like that And it was fire up until that point because, I mean, I guess it didn't really match the beat. How, like, when Shorty Shorty, the hook or whatever, is bitch you a dog, and then like, bitch you a, bitch you a, bitch you a, bitch you a. That part better than Wiz Khalifa, the big car, big truck, big something, yeah, that. Like, the bounce with the beat. But, um, and then the transition between him and A Boogie, I mean, I guess that's what people said it wasn't that great. I mean, it's all right. I mean, but A Boogie, I mean, he came into the song, like, you know, Heavy, like he came into it, but I mean, what's Khalifa? I mean, he, what's Khalifa? I don't know. Right now, I feel like what's Khalifa part was better than A Boogie's, but A Boogie's part had like better, I guess, metaphors or similes or whatever you want to call it, where he said something like Kim and po Kim Possible or some shit like that. But it's it's all right. Girl, how you gonna tell me that you don't want me to be in you? <laughs> tell what they what everybody was commenting about shorty shorty's like vocals they do sound kind of it's not like they sound off they just sound like because he redid it you could tell but it just sounds like he i don't know bro <laughs> it don't sound i mean i think the original sounds better and i feel like the structure of the song itself isn't like perfect i guess i mean i feel like a Boogie and Wiz Khalifa could have done. Like, their transitions and stuff could have been better. And I feel like the vocals could have been better. And I feel like just, like, breaking up their verses. Because 
he well after a boogie rap, he just went straight into his second verse, which was good from the reg original song, but you could tell the vocals were different. So I mean, it's all right. I mean, I'm gonna finish off the video and then I'll probably talk some more. Hold on, two it's two thirty two right now, twenty six seconds left. <laughs> So, you know, that's the end of the audio. Let me sit that out. That's the end of the audio. Um. Cup, you a dog and your hunger too. But yeah, um. So, my reaction of it, I mean. What'd I give it? I gave the song a. The original is like a, I, the original I'd give like an 8 out of, no, the original is probably like a 9.9, .9 probably a 10 out of 10, bro. The original, because it's a catchy, one, it's original, it's catchy, and I mean, he talked, after the Genius video, after, if you look at the Genius video, he's actually talking like, you know, he's not, he doesn't seem like an idiot, bro. Like, a lot of these new rappers, bro, he's not an idiot. So, like, he is actually saying, like, real stuff, like, yeah, girls are, he was, he was on the phone with two girls or whatever, and. She hung up from him, or for hung up from his homeboy, or whatever, and called another dude. And he was like, "Oh, you a dog?" So he rapping about real, like, real stuff. But um, the remix, uh, something should not just should just not be remixed. Uh, it's not trash at all. I feel like Wiz Khalifa part was better than A Boogie's. I don't know why everybody just say A Boogie's part was better. I don't think so. I think Wiz Khalifa. Let's play this part was better. Hey Boogie, he good. I just feel like I'm his music ain't just like just ain't for me. Like some of his songs. Now he do got some bangers, but I feel like on features, nah, he his features don't need to be. They shouldn't be like that. I don't think his features are all of that. But he rich, I'm not. So <laughs> so I not yet. But <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I mean, it was straight, though. Let's go for part, I think, was good, though. Until, like, the big car, big truck, big something. I mean, I guess it's catchy, but it was all right. But his his verse, like, most of his verse was fine. Like, the sax was, he said, I think he said something in his house, some in his bedroom or something. His house was, like, sax or something. It was fire. But, um, yeah, I mean, basically, yeah, that's all I can really say about the video, I mean, the audio. I mean, if they do do a video, which I doubt they will, but uh, if they do do a video for the remix, which, like I said, I doubt they will, then I'll react to it. If not, then it'll just be another video on the channel. <laughs> so, yeah, um, that's the end of the video. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I might put the thing on the screen that says subscribe. So, you show you how to subscribe down below underneath the video. Click the red button and post notification bell. So, you don't miss out on any videos. Make sure you share with your people. Get us out there. We on the road to 1K. We trying to get a thousand subs. And yeah, we just gonna keep dropping videos. Lindsay and I will be dropping videos. We'll be doing more challenges and stuff soon. We've been super busy, but I'm gonna end the video. So I'm gonna see y'all next time. So take you to mall, buy you whatever you want. I buy you each and one. Take you to mall, buy you whatever you want. I buy you each and one. Take you to mall, buy you whatever you want. I buy you each and one. Take you to mall, buy you whatever.